Good afternoon. It's a beautiful Saturday afternoon here in the Toronto area. Early September, getting on towards fall. And today, I'm gonna start to ride the TTC Line 2. Stopping at every station and having a look around to see what's at each of them. So we're gonna start at the east end of the line, Kennedy Station. Now, this was extended in to 1980. Used to only run as far as Woodside from Keel to Line 2, but then they extended it out here. And then they extended it again in 1985, bringing Line 3, which unfortunately is now shut down. And we're getting another extension here which will be line five. Where we can see the doors to the station building that will be part of line five. And line five, otherwise known as the Crosstown Eglinton LRT, still hasn't got a date when it will open yet. It was meant to open a couple of years ago. It's now 2023, and we still don't even know when it's gonna open, maybe next year. So here we are, ready to get our train out of here. The train here is going to be on this left hand side platform. The next stop is Warden. Once again, Greenwood Station is pretty close to the Danforth. Not too close to Greenwood Avenue itself though. We're about a block away from there. But I'm spending a little extra time here because there's something rather interesting to see if you wander down Greenwood Avenue just a little further. And here, as we approach the corner of Oakvale and Greenwood, we start to see the sprawling complex that is the line two maintenance yard at greenwood avenue here we go you can see the end of this yard from the lakeshore east down line that is down at the bottom and it's just along the end and while you can't see it below us, there is the portal to the main tunnels uh, with a small station halt for staff to get on and off the trains.
station is my most favorite station on line two at least east of Young. Uh, if we look at the station it's had a considerable amount of refurbishment compared to all of the other stations. We've got nice artwork, we have a nice colored line up at the top, uh, not so scummy tiles. It's just generally nicer here. Even some artwork with uh, images of some local uh, local businesses, there's uh, some images from the station itself. It's just nice here. I'm not sure if there's anything like that west of Young. I don't tend to do that particular line, uh, section of the line too often, but in a later episode I will head down there and we will find out. But for now, that's going to do it for this particular episode. In a future one, we will go further west and we will pick up at Chester, which is the next station down the line. And yeah, thanks for joining.